A year ago, on this day, the history of a new Europe, more united and resilient, has begun. EU leaders, backed up by the support of the citizens, made it clear that they see Ukraine as a future member of the EU, as a part of the family of free democratic European nations. Extraordinary times require extraordinary decisions. Exactly one year ago, the European Council granted candidate status to Ukraine, offering membership in the EU. It was a historic moment, both for Ukraine and the European Union as a whole. Along with the candidate statues, we heard a unanimous yes from all 27 friends who promised to stand with Ukraine for as long as it is taking. We have not forgotten that unity. Every Ukrainian has seen clearly they were not alone in their fight for independence, for freedom, for dignity and the right to live and live in a free and democratic society. Despite all the Russian attempts to break us, Ukrainians stand strong against the brutal aggression. But we are standing equipped by German martyrs and leopards, French Caesars and Italian Aspide. As a resilient society, also equipped with a face in our sovereign, prosperous European future. And this future in the, is enshrined into the reform pace, targeted to meet the criteria for EU membership, constant missile attacks and continuous war crimes, including ecocide of the Ukrainian soil, make our determination only stronger. You know it very well, because it is about preparing our country for victory. Reform of judiciary, fight against corruption, vested interests, preventing money laundering, launching the massive media reform and ensuring the rights of national minorities and the basic human rights. All of these areas needed decisions and key decisions have been taken. Decisions that seemed impossible for years. It is crucial for Ukraine to continue the pace of reforms. EU accession is merit-based and in all countries in Central and Eastern Europe Successful EU integration was always based on a strong domestic consensus, as is there in Ukraine today. We are finalizing the implementation of seven recommendations of European Commission in ongoing consultations with European partners. We have started a large-scale self-screening of all Ukrainian legislation subject to its compliance with the EU law, with the EU acquis. We launched several programs for civil servants who will be massively trained uh, to be prepared to align ourselves with the EU. And we are not waiting, but we're taking actions. We prepare ourselves for European integration. We prepare ourselves for the accession talks. The EU stands with the Ukrainian people. You belong to the European family and we share a common future. Step by step, together, we will become stronger more resilient and more united than ever.